Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Octung Cthulhu Tactics. I'm your host, Bring It Dawn, and here we are in Operation uh -oh. Operation Strange Brew. Uh, Moving out. Check out this way first. The game definitely got a lot easier once I started doing all the side quests. Uh -huh. I again, I thought you got to do two story quests. I just didn't. I didn't bother reading. Those details eluded me. Here we go. I'm a little at odds with myself though, because like how I want to describe the game is like a it's almost cute. But it's it's a Cthulhu game, so you don't really wanna Like, oh that game is cute. That's the best way to describe it. Um, only 24. And if you take a guy on the first turn, do so. Seventy-eight percent chance and ninety-eight percent chance. Yeah, I just realized he's not actually in cover. <laughs> like, I put it there and I realized that it, it didn't say he was in cover. But, I mean, it looks like cover. But I thought maybe it's just because they couldn't see him. I mean, obviously they can. Okay, he's gonna get charged by C. For sure. Mystery man. Come here. Help me. Another enemy is no more. All right. There's a few ways we could play this, I think. Let's do it this way. You just need to find cover. Like, why is this not considered cover? It's so bothersome. Like, uh, this little chunk of wall right here doesn't count as cover either. Like, why? Why not? Oh well. Leave this to me. Coolio. D percent chance. I'll take it. I have a good setup for next turn. You know, unless all their shots hit. All right. Go ahead and get on in there, big guy. Huzzah! Then one melee attack later. Less enemies to worry about. Um. Only fifty-eight percent chance to hit. So. So good. I don't think Singh is actually revealing that guy. There we go. Let's see what we got now. 78% chance. 
I'll take it. Coolio. Definitely took more damage than I intended to. Well, I guess it was just him. It's crazy that I thought he actually took damage. But it was just his, uh. Just his luck. Moving out. Well, nothing back there. That was just the Nazis' fallback point. Alright, deeper into the compound. Uh oh, what happened here? There's gonna be a lot of cover for me. That looks like a melee creature. That's probably what I do first, since I want to finish people off on the first turn. Go here, then activate Ward Light. There we go. Eyes on the prize. Yeah, definitely want to take out the lieutenant first. Get rid of that buff he's giving everybody. We're safe to put her. Might just have her fall back for now. Sounds powerful. Can't get him into any sort of safety. I'll just hold on to that for now. And what I need to do is probably get him up here so that we can out. see the enemies. But it's just no. This, all right, there's at least three, which means well, not in range. On my way. All right, that guy's flanked. Go for him. Let's double tap him. Or not. It's fine too. I really want to double tap him anyway. Alright. I mean, he has to move. Let's get him up here. I mean, no sense of wasting willpower just to put him back into a similar position. Let's all put as much damage into him as we can. There we go. No, that's okay. I mean, if the guy sucks, I mean, I guess I don't have to worry about cover at all. Me. 
No. You son of a gun. Only 63% chance to hit with him. Uh, I'd rather use him, because uh, he reloads by himself. I can reload for him. Or with him this turn. Like that. I think they're over here. Yep, that was right. Because that's where the camera panned me when there was movement over there. I use my detective powers to reveal that secret. I'm over here sleuthing it out. Well, hello. What are you just uh, I mean, it's not bad. I'll take it. Yeah, that's why I asked a little too much there. I'll take another shot. Hmm. Okay. Well. I'll make sure to miss all these shots. Now there's another enemy I might be screwed next turn. It's not. We're good. We're still, still in good shape, everybody. Let's check back here. Oh, it all leads into this warehouse thing anyway. Oh yeah, we're going this way. Yeah, it's just kind of enemy group, followed by enemy group. There's not like a lot of breaks in between. Which is fine, I mean, I'm all about the action here. Yeah, he's bound to miss eventually. He hasn't hit like two turns, three turns. Taking the shot. Okay. Next time, Charlie. My way. Leave this to me. Leave this to me. There we go. There's a lieutenant. This is like another lieutenant, judging by his uh, silhouette. That's oh, that noise guy. Gross. It's alright, we finish him this turn. He's still exposed. Let's get him over here. And you can't go anywhere. So just enter.
I mean, seventy percent chance. I'll take it. Thank you. You're finally hitting something. It had been a while. He's about to lose his place on the squad. There he is. Hello, friend. Well, I may as well use that on him. So I get those three will points back. Or momentum points. Better watch already. Fascinating. Easy peasy. On my no way. Sweat. What have we here? They moved in some serious heavy lifting equipment. Why the devil would they need that? Lieutenant Sid Sapper Brown. Moving out. Uh, lift heavy things, honestly. As ever, if you're barging into an enemy's base, an enemy's house, you should expect a warm welcome. Captain Hill. Moving out. I saw one guy off the, over there to the right. And a noise guy. Oh, he should be easy to take care of. Criticals. All right. Unless I can finish him off with somebody else and save myself some momentum. Let's go finish him off. two over there. That's fine. We'll be okay. Well, he might not. Yeah, see? That's very accurate. They're already kind of committed to this flank, so I'm going to keep pushing this way and then take out the guys over there. Everybody seems accurate. What the heck, man. Alright, a couple things I can do here. One. I'm gonna take this guy out. Well, hold on. I think we can do better here. First things first, let's revive this guy. 
so I'll have to worry about rescuing him later. Then he... Take this shot here. Seventy-eight percent chance. Taking the shot. Of course not. What was I thinking? All right. Good. One less we got to worry about. percent chance to hit. I don't like those odds. On my way. Leave this to me. I focus on him, he's eventually going to go down. That's inevitable. Crisis of leadership, that's new. Well... So I'm going to use him for something else, but let's pick this guy up. How oh, cool, you go in here and like flank around if you wanted to. Darn, I really wanted to throw a grenade over there this time. Okay, you can't charge in. Can't really do a whole lot, actually. Let's get him over here, I guess. Taking the shot. Help me. It's Coolio. All right, how do I want to play her? I can put her right here. I guess it doesn't really matter. Pop off some shots. One in four chance to hit. Maybe one of them. Yeah. Coolio. Even better. Alright, end turn. One enemy left. <laughs> of course he did. Of course he did that. Alright, let's deal with this as best I know how. There we go. Extra five damage because he has the uh, 75 stress. Combat ending. Oh wow, Mr. that over. Okay. Oh yeah, yes it is. Ignore what I'm saying. The mission is over. It's like, this is pretty long compared to the met, most of them. Should be a level up. Kapow. Ooh, five skill points. Ammunition fused with Blower Crystal. Or Crystal. Increases weapon damage by five. That's pretty good. Ooh, next one. Look at all that stuff you get. Demo charge and basic flexible scope. So five damage, I could probably give it to her. In all honesty, because oh, I mean the crit's nice and all. But the guaranteed five damage. Her crit chance right now. It's just plus zero percent, but she has this equipped. So there's only a five percent chance to. Oh, 
Yeah, it's just a 5% chance to crit. If I can just do a guaranteed 5... 5 more damage, I think it'd be better. How much does this cost? Oh, 8. And how do I get these? Do I have to like... Oh, I'll probably have to like get this one as well and then unlock that one. Hmm. Yeah, you probably have to get the ones on each side of it to get like this. Is what I'm guessing. Does not stack with the cover penalty. That's lame. Yeah, so yeah, it actually shows you what it's, or it's required. So I need to get... What's this do? Oh, whenever you attack an enemy, trigger the miasma skill centered on yourself. That's pretty good. I just need miasma, which costs, what, two? And then three. This is also really good, though. I kind of want to try this out. So if I get my asthma, do a five damage to all characters within two tiles. Yeah, so he'll be able to finish people off with this. And then if you get this, yeah, you can get any increased damage and everything. That seems pretty good. Oh, you can always get retraining as well. So if I don't like what I got. Okay. Steady aim. Each range attack that hits grants stacking 5% bonus to all subsequent attacks made by this character until next turn. Special shot. And it's not like a. It doesn't say there's a chance. It says that you just take 20 damage. So I want to save up for that. One more level up should get him that, and then let's see. Yeah, I'm gonna save up for the rapid fire skills for him. I get her anything, right? Just has five skill points. Oh, that's pretty cool. It's also pretty cool. A little teleport. This might be worth getting to increase range weapon accuracy and critical chance by ten. Let's get that. This is really good. I'm saving up for this. I mean, I could need Siphon, of course, but... I mean, range attack with your main weapon if it hits, the enemy also suffers some life drain. How's that not, like, super OP? I think that is super OP. Because their life drain does 24 damage. I just... I don't, I don't know if I understand. Now, now I'm wondering if maybe it's better to stack the... Um, crit with her. Now she has that 10 crit. So the critical chance isn't moving up. She has plus 10 with her ability. This would be plus 15 that I know of. Yeah, 5 extra damage is, is I think, too good to get a uh, pass up. I'm curious, is there anything that would be worth... Yeah, he doesn't really have anything that I'm interested in. What does Combat Guardian do? Yeah. Yeah, he doesn't really have anything that I want. This might not be bad, hitting more Mythos enemies. Oh, well. We're gonna call it here. Well, let's go ahead and jump into the next side mission. And then we'll call it. As is tradition. The Resistance reports one of those Black Sun villains was seen burying an unknown object near the Stone Circle. 
Your job? Investigate the burial site and see if you can recover that artifact. It might be a trap, but equally, it may just prove to be something of immense value. All right, we'll call it here. The next episode, we'll pick up in... I don't know what mission this is. But anyway, uh, thanks for watching, and I hope to see you all there.